everybody, welcome to my channel. I am Tracy Reed and this is Acrylic Pouring with Friends. I hope you guys are having a fabulous day. Uh, in today's video, it's kind of fun, I got asked to participate in a collab by Heather Renee. Um, she got a bunch of ladies together for a Spring Into Color collab. So I'm very excited to get started. I have got some really pretty colors here, and I'm going to be doing an open cup. Um, I haven't decided which size. I don't think I'm going to use the big one. I'm not sure. Anyway, while I'm talking, I'm deciding. <laughs> so that should be fun. I don't do a lot of open cups. I used to a while back, um, but I thought it would kind of be fun the way that the colors kind of come out and explode into the colors. It kind of reminds me of flowers in spring, how all of a sudden they're there and there's just all these beautiful flowers, beautiful colors. Um, and I got my nails done with some really cute flowers and the colors are just super pretty. So, so that's what I'm going to do. Um, and I think I've decided I'm going to use this one, but I can't leave it there right now because <laughs> I have to get my canvas going. But first I am going to tell you what colors I'm using. So it looks like most of them are from Liquitex Basics. So I've got Quinacridone Magenta. This one is Ultramarine Blue. I have got Prism Violet. I love this purple. This is just a gorgeous, gorgeous color. And then this one is Turquoise Blue. And then I've got, this one's from Folkar, and it is Yellow Flash. Now Yellow and I have a love-hate, so we're going to see... If I actually go through with using it, there's so many pretty yellow flowers in, in the springtime, so I'm planning on it, so we'll see. <laughs> and then the last one I've got is going to be um, from Folk Art as well, and it is white pearl, pearl white. Um, I'm going to use really a lot of, of that. Um, that'll be what I'll put down first, and then I'll put the other colors in there. So I'm going to get my lids off of my bottles here so I can get going with this. And I am very, very um, excited that um, I got asked to participate in this fun collab with all these wonderful, talented ladies. Very excited to get started here. All right, so let me get my gloves on. And then we can get going. All right, so I've got all the lids off of my bottles. My gloves are on. I think I am ready to go. And first, I'm going to, I think I'm going to start over like up here. I'm going to put a little puddle down. And all of my paints are mixed with my regular pouring medium, which for me, I've been using the same pouring medium for, oh, geez, three and a half-ish maybe a little more years, uh, Liquitex, pouring medium, flow trout water, and some GAC 800. All right, so I've got that down. Put a little bit more in there. And then I'm just going to go start through, start putting the colors in. I don't really know if I have an order like that. I have to be aware because sometimes with this yellow, it has a tendency of doing some funky stuff, especially with you got purple in there as well. So I think that is what I'm going to start with first is the, is the violet. And I like to pour up a little high. Okay. And then I'm going to, in between each one, I'm going to put a little bit of the white pearl in there. And then I'm just going to go through. All right, so here we go.
up. So I'm going to use my new tool that I got, wedge tool. And I think I'm going to kind of just make some cool designs through it. So we'll see, because I love this whole area. That yellow really uh, turned out really, really good. And there's no mud or anything. So if they don't like what I did there, there was a chunk. And I had to get rid of it. But I love everything else. Ugh. So you know what? Whatever. I'm just going to go do it. This is fun. I think. <laughs> I think. what I was going for but I love it I actually love it the yellow looks really really cool it kind of blended really nice with that purple okay guys so I'm gonna take you down for a little bit of close-up and then hopefully uh, at the end of the video you will be able to see it dry all right everybody here we go with the dried result and I absolutely love it I love everything about this painting the colors are so vibrant and it really didn't go as I was hoping because sometimes open cups have a mind of their own um, and then I had a little mishap with a little um, piece of paint a little lump in there and then I ended up taking my new wedge tool and using that and I think it really added a whimsicalness to the painting which when I looked at it at first I thought it reminded me of a, a spring fairy garden so I think it looks really cool and I showed it to my sister and she thought it looked like half of it looked wintry and then the other half looked like like the flowers in spring so like that part there with the yellow and then the purple reminded her of irises which i love i love a, a gorgeous iris so i would love to hear what you guys think of my painting you can leave a comment below and don't forget to like my video and subscribe to my channel if you have not already and also if you are interested in any of the acrylic pouring tools that you saw me use in my video today they are available at acrylicpourringtools.com along with all of my other acrylic pouring tools. And make sure to stay tuned because Denise Wade White is coming up next. I really do hope you guys are enjoying our Spring Into Color collab and I hope you have a fabulous, fabulous day.